Welcome back to another episode. All right, guys, I'm going to show y'all how good this Formula One color wax, black color wax, does here on this dark blue blemish faded light paint. And you can mold on this and scrub on it and buff on it all you want to. I see nothing that really helps a lot, but something that kind of fill in any white patches. All right, guys, I'm going to show you guys here. This is how I look. Black. Talked about it before. I'll show you guys. This is about the only thing that I really see that really make this stuff look so much better. Look at here. It just takes something with pigments in it and kind of fill it in. No matter what anybody say, that's the only thing I really see that really works. Because you got to think about it. On this Nissan Pathfinder, is that that the clear is deteriorated some here. But what I can do, I can just paint the hood black instead of just getting the cut up the color code off. Watch this, guys. Check this out. Right. Show you guys how I do it. Sometimes it just ain't no help, but the daggone use pigments here. Kind of color this stuff in a little bit. That's all I see. <laughs> if y'all got this problem on any kind of car, it's blaming a lot of new cars, especially man, because they, they paint them now so cheap. They're so cheap. They use cheap paint on them now. So, you know, these newer cars are worse than the older ones, man. They don't they don't put no time into painting them. They just want to sell them, you know. I can see the older vehicles is prone to it because they're older, you know. But you got cars like 2015s and 16s with the, with the paint fading off of them, you know. I've seen it, especially on Hondas. Damn paint fade off them. Premature, you know. So let's go ahead and bump this off and show you guys. See here, I mean, the pigments from it pretty much already done a good job here. As you can see. Yeah. But it's faded. You can see it's faded. But it's not as bad. See there? Pigments kind of getting in there, kind of helping it. The real key is painting it, you know. But I'm just <laughs> trying to make it a little better. Let's keep it real, you know. The real key to it is get some paint and paint that mug. You know, no matter you paint it black to match the bumpers or whatever, but it looks better than the other side. See the difference? It don't look all white and patchy. You see there? It's how white and patchy that is. Yeah. It don't look that bad, see? Still can see it, but it ain't quite as bad as that. See the difference? Kind of blend it down some, you know. It's going to be there. Even from a distance, you can't even see it all. See there? But you can see the driver's side. See the difference? From a... Look at it. You still can see that patch. Over here, you can see it, but not as good. See there? So it's a quick pass to help fix it. But nothing really going to fix it perfect because the clear coat is deteriorated there. So I could easily just paint the hood black. It'll look good black too, so to match the wheels and the trim. So, yeah. All right, y'all. Hit that subscribe, man. The next time your boy's out. Showing y'all the ropes. Showing you the ropes. Showing you the ropes. Showing you the ropes. I'm out of here. Got to wipe out the Tesla. Peace.